All right, so we are going to be using my Dolly Tea deck to see what comes through while I'm in the Starbucks line because, you know, Mama needs her fix. I need her fix. All right, here we go. What do we got? In bed crying over you. Who are you crying over, boo-boo? This too shall pass, I promise you. But make sure you release it because if you don't release it, it's going to be stuck in your body and you don't want that fuck shit energy stuck in your body. So you got to feel it to heal it. Allow yourself to feel it. Even if it hurts severely, take as much time as you need, whatever you're going through. All right. Allow it to exit your body. Okay. There could have been people involved and, in, you know, maybe you were being gang stalked. Maybe you were being bullied, maybe perhaps like a bunch of girls were against you at work or in a, you know, work environment, perhaps, you know, someone you were dealing with as in a love connection or a love, um, like a soul connection or a karmic, whatever, there could have been more than one person they were involved with and it was just like hit after hit for you and it was just too much energetically, so... You are emotionally tired and exhausted, mentally spent. You just want to be in bed, all right? Um, you found out that this person was meeting up with other women. Again, there was more involved. Uh, somebody was against you. Somebody was against you and somebody else being together. Some, Even their family were against you. They were probably plotting so let's say if that person's sister wanted her brother with somebody else, they would conspire, and you knew it intuitively. Shit like that happens. Um, let's see. We've got Capricorn energy. We are in a – we're entering Capricorn season really soon. So something – someone could be a Capricorn. You are, they are, or something's going to happen in Capricorn season where everything will be exposed. And it hurt you the most because you were there to help this person. I just saw two, two, two. Um, you you could have saved this person a lot financially. You could have been there for them. Every time they needed you, you were there. You were like fucking Mrs. Mrs. Batman, okay? They took advantage of you. And I feel like now you're getting over this person. You're getting over them after a period of healing and, like, purging and releasing you're going to start feeling better. It says, praise the Lord. Praise the universe that you're finally going to get over that situation. You're being called out of it because those people that did you dirty, maybe try to take from you, became thieves, whether they were emotional thieves, energetic, abundant, whatever. Um, Karma is going to get them really, really bad. And I feel like you're going to get a huge payout from the divine and you're going to feel emotionally better, energetically better, and, and also have new love perhaps coming in. We have Aquarius energy. You or somebody else could be an Aquarius. We have Gemini energy here. Ooh, shit. Yeah, caught. You could have caught an Aquarius with a Gemini or you will in Capricorn season. That combo has been interesting this whole year. So air signs are on some other level this year. So let's see here. Yeah, someone's about to get caught. Maybe you caught them all. About that, I had a, a call for my daughter. Okay, it says don't tell him yet, sis. So if you see something, something's about to be exposed to you, the universe is like, don't let them know just yet. Um just walk away i feel like you don't even have to confront them just walk away cry it out if you need to okay they don't need to know about you because why do they care to know about you if they were doing shit behind your back right yeah ignore it says ignoring people don't like it when you ignore them but they love to fucking do you dirty um yeah see it says my best without you ignore them who gives a shit you're going to be better off without this group of people or family or love interest. Anyways, energetically, you're going to be feeling good. Your money is going to get better. You're going to be thriving because you're letting go of the parasitic entities that were trying to latch uh, themselves to you and try to take from you. Okay. 
All right, so let's see what else is coming through. All right, if you still have photos with this person, um, you want to get rid of it from your phone. You don't, you don't want memories to come back. I'm not saying delete them or anything, but like get rid of it so it's like put away and you don't have to see it because stuff like that carries energy. There could have been spell work connected to all this bullshit. Someone could have, could have got in between the connection or done some spell work. They could have gotten what they wanted at the time is what I'm hearing, but someone's about to catch an STD. That's not good. We don't wish that upon anybody, but someone, someone thinks they're funny and cute by fucking around with multiple people because we did get more involved card here. Some Look, some shady shit. Somebody was doing some shady shit through spell work and that shit's about to backfire. Yep. Why? Because now they're going to see you rising. You're going to be center stage and the universe is going to be blessing you and all your haters and that love interest is going to be watching you thrive and they're not going to be able to fucking function. Literally, it says can't function. All right. So we also have Aries energy. This could be you dealing with the Aries. Um, or you can have strong Aries in your chart. Okay. Somebody's going to get played. Whoever this person cheated on you with, that person's going to play them. They might even give them an STD, STI, whatever. And that's how they get, end up getting played. Yeah. Ooh, damn. You see how karma works? Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Anyways, that's what's coming through. Hope you enjoy.